It's going to be nothing but pain in Vampire Survivors today, as Ramba has got to go to Whiteout. This is going to end beyond poorly. Fact. Can't get that. Greatest Jubilee? Yes, I have to get the strongest possible I can in order to survive with Ramba. I don't have a choice otherwise. It's Ramba. Now, the stage has given stronger characters worse runs. At least I can go get that one. Spinage. Okay, there's everything to go. Is it this cave? No, it's another one. Wait, why did that graphic present? Oh. I mean, at least having other weapons, I'm not going to be relying on Karelo, which is terrible. But, you know, it's still Ramba. Karelo is still terrible. And I'm not going to get enough to upgrade fully, even then. Well, uh, you know, upgraded fully is fine. That's feasible. That's likely. That's going to happen. It's getting the duplicator up from level ups that I meant. Okay, rush down. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, first snowman wave is gone. Anyway, I need as much damage as possible because Ramba's terrible. That's why I have Spinach Toronis box, and then Empty Tome is Empty Tome. Gotta get that Photon Storm because it's the only way Ramba's gonna survive this. Then after that, it's a lot easier characters like O Soul and Ambrojo. Oh, I suppose in theory I could just sit in front of the cave entrance and jam out that way. And 70 cooldown, and it still fires out so bloody slowly. I'll get my damage max as soon as possible. Alrighty. Phaser? Phaser, yeah. Get that photon storm ASAP if I can. It's probably... Oh. <sighs> phaser first. Phaser first and only. That's going to be doing all the work here. Hey, NFT. I can use that when it gets dicey, which is every time with Ramba. And the duplicator, the amount is going to help later, but right now, it's still helpful. But raw stats would be very helpful as well. Able's finisher. Okay, that's the bottom of the screen safe. Well, it takes out the snowman okay. That's not the problem, though. The problem's gonna be at the end. With the super snowman, and I finally put it to mind, but it's not Amaretsu, it is Kazune. Probably Kazune. Specifically not Kitsune, Kizune. Heyo. Well, more like Zeo. Power Ranger Zeo, stronger than before. Go Zeo, powered up for more. Go Zeo. I don't know if when copyright strings come or if my singing is even. Well, it's terrible enough not to be. Or if my voice is accurate enough to actually be caught 
as copyright infringement. Well, granted, not that I have any. Da da da. -da. Moolahs to be given up. Hey, max out Kralo. Now it's only completely terrible instead of bottoms out, no success at all terrible. Man, so many Octolarians on this one. Oh, right. These are not evolved yet. Photon Storm isn't evolved yet, so I can't go random always. And I do need to be that specific about it, because it is white out. I've lost too many super solid runs, just a nonsense. Holy Kali Dokli. Nothing here. Three bounces, I guess. Not like I'm going to get much benefit from anything else, either. Doesn't mean more carts, even if less carts. Still not great, though. What was that? Oh, light sources from Greatest Jubilee. Get that with Heart of Fire. Oh, actually, Heart of Fire would not have been the worst. That would have been something like Iron Blue Will. Yeah, that's Walter Pearl set as the Corello. Ooh, amount or duration. Why'd you come at the same time, you? Okay, it turns out with actual weapons, this one loses a lot of its teeth, but still, that big bad snowman wave at the end is going to be tough. And also how strange the evolution chest works on this one doesn't help as well. Well, if the robot wave is get pushed back, it's okay. Wait, what? That wasn't an evolution chest? Jeez. A bunch of small clovers on the map. Let's see if I can grab any. There's one. Uh, da, 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 two. Hey, Rosary. And another Aura Logan. And another Aura Logan. I think there's a nice small clover over here. Yep. I have a ton of free luck. Definitely not going to save him. It's not like luck does anything. Actually, now I think about it, the red of their crits, so maybe it actually is critting with phaser. Elite speak. Well, I wasn't expecting it to go so smooth, so in the end it's going to be a nightmare, isn't it? Oh, that's Vampire Survivors for you. Feast or Famine, Famine or Feast. What does area, or what does speed even do for Greatest Jubilee? Oh, gotta get that area up. Make those carts as big as there are. Honestly, I was hoping to run into Carlo Kart, because at least that would be funny there. The one map he could be good on. He's not bad on Inlay Library, but still. Other characters dominate Inlay Library. He's just not bad. Yeah, he's definitely one of the worst weapons possible for Silent Old Sanctuary, huh? Just very little benefit. Wow, oh, more clovers. Another robot wave get pushed back, but that's probably the power of the phaser. And greatest jubilee than anything Carlo Cardi. Carelo Cardi. Carelloween. I got there eventually. What the heck is that chest? I don't need anything else, I just need empty tome and phaser. There we go. Twelve minutes in, jeez. With a shortened stage. It still shows up later than it would in any other normal stage. Guess maybe to compensate for the paradise of consumables that can drop from the snowmen. 
Oh, that's not good. I think there's so many Orologians around. Yeah, this is being carried by Photon Storm and Greatest Jubilee. Man. Can't believe after all this time my mind has not gotten any sharper. My commentary has not gotten any better. Either way, thanks for watching. Oh, maybe one person who goes this far. I see those analytics. Anyway, uh, by the time this gets posted, there's only one more day till Operation Guns, and I need to know what time that comes out. So, I can actually, you know, get the Arcana. Even as strong as it is, it's still white out. And it's still Ramba. What the heck was that? Good grief, NFT. I refuse to believe the carts did that. Hey, level up Storm. Yeah, there's like 200 from the Corelo carts. That's nothing. Totally the NFT doing all of the work. Oh, stop hitting me. Let's just go grab another Orologian and another. Ah, oh, there's an NFT and an Orologian. So you'll go down in no time. Give me another chest that I don't really use. Okay, time to find some good power ups to camp. Oh, might as well grab that. Okay, two Oral Logans right next to each other. Ah, I know what I do. After Operation Guns comes out, I'm gonna, you know, do first wave with all of them, and then second wave with all of them, plus Santa and Gyorun Tin. That would be the best way to do it. That way I can immediately get 40 plus more out of the bez, like, oh no. No, oh, the fourth wave is the only thing that's going to save me. Yeah. If I'm still alive by the time that comes, wow, even the snowmen aren't getting in. This is so completely overpowered compared to what I've been running here, huh? Well, I wasn't expecting Ramba to have the easy time. But I guess having actual weapons is very helpful. That way he actually gets to use his amount bonus. Bye death, bye death. Ah yes, Corelo's amazing sub-million damage. Less than Phaser. <laughs> oh, Corelo, you're so bad. It is mind-boggling. Okay, if so, Ramba can one-shot it, then O'Soul should have no trouble whatsoever. And if he does, I will be baffled. Because so, there's no world in which I will ever say that O'Soul is worse than Ramba. Just not wanting to give me anything I need, huh? You aren't even giving me... Not even giving me Celestial Dusting. Alright, get that circle of dust a-going. Well, I could do that. Could. Uh, seriously, where's the whip? Silver wind I get, it's kind of lower, but still, the whip. The whip is always supposed to be always up. Or at least give me celestial dusting levels if I can heal. Oh, Paco Ballier. Remember, it's 0.2 health back from Pomerola. Oh, and recovering should increase heart heal, right? 
Why am I asking you? You're watching. You can't answer me except in the comments below. There you are, Whip. Been a while. Yeah, not that long. Da -da 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 -da. All right, much better. Get some healing back. Not quite the wave clear nonsense that Rombo was getting up to, but then again, I am not doing Phaser and Photon Storm. And Greatest Jubilee, so it should come as no surprise. Whipping it white out. Is that a name? Old man, good boy, and top man. Going to wait out. Ah oh man, too long. Curse you, algorithm. Curse you. Oh yeah. Until I get silver wind, I don't have much way to clear out the snowman's two eyes. More whips. More fun. Not here. Not ever. Garlic, you're not silver wind. No empty tome either, yeesh. Ooh, I should grab that. That way I can run into things. And with hearts being dropped, I'm a lot safer. Whipping it good. Yeah, I can just run into them. It'll only get worse once I get Sarabande. And hey, empty tome finally, geez. Wait. Am I even hitting anything with Celestial Dusting? Well, I must be. I'm getting health back. I, I don't have Bloody Tear yet. How much damage do these do? A lot. And I can still go up north. I can still follow the wet path pretty safely. Or I could get an Aura Logan and just charge through everything invincible like. Yeah, that's the ticket. It's a lot better than Rama doing nothing. Okay, the audio is captured. I want another video without that. You never know when OBS will just randomly decide to screw you over, huh? That would sure be nice. A silver wing showed up. Is that it? That's not silver wing. That's not silver wing at all. Uh-oh. That's not good. Well, time to start banishing things till Silver Wind shows up. Whip damage is good. And it's fast. Antonio is a strong character. I will bat for this multiple times. He's not the most exciting. I will admit that. But one armor. More damage. And the ability to use the Bloody Tear are all good abilities. I should really try to do that tier list. Maybe I should wait till Gun's out. Oh, I finally do have a... well, not a full break, but... I have less things to directly stream. So I can actually work on other stuff. Maybe just a quick match or two of Starship Troopers Extermination. Till I get everything else worked out. That'll be for, well, the same day I'm posting this. I mean, do I want to stream the Vampire Survivors? I could. I could probably stream and record.
Much better option than that. That's not a chest that evolves things. Wait, what? Why are you evolving? No, you're giving me a candy box. Which I actually want to use to get the silver wind because it refused to spawn in. There we go. There's my little petals. Ah, that this feels somehow more strenuous than Ramba after all of my trash talk on him. That's how it goes sometimes. Silver Wind? How could you lose? Well, I suppose you could lose if you purchase it and then never use it. Glances at weight set. <laughs> that was so much money I didn't need to spend. And yet, having it there is a constant reminder to use it. Alright, almost got festive wins. Will I even get enough chests to evolve both of them? Oh, robot wave. Hey, bloody tear, nice. Yeah, I am more invincible. Sixteen health? Oh man. Just try and stop me now. Look at them trying and failing. Failing so hard, like Ramba. Didn't. So they're anti Rambas. You heard it first here, folks. The opposite of a robot is a ghost of an old man. Well, it is only 1% area. That guy gets charged through him. Wasn't expecting that out of the robots. I like also charge back to all those power ups, but why? Let's go exploring. Whoever goes this far, I would on wait out. I sure don't. Ooh, a mount one, excellent. Oh, there's a thing here. Or is there any super secrets inside that no one has ever found yet? Doesn't look like it. Alas, I will not be the one to discover a super secret. What was that thing I did discover that never announced? So it might still actually be secret. Well, that's already off to a good start. Can I just tank through your stuff? Yeah, I don't I don't need to flee. I'll just heal up. Hey, Arcana chest. Uh, anything to actually use. Beginning. I mean, might as well. Yep, no trouble here. And I suppose I'll eat those words once I need awake from when. Man, without inverse, they're so puny. And with festive winds, you're even punier. You're gonna last like half as long, yeah, not even that. Festive winds is good, guys. And girls. And other. Man, why are the fires continuing past them that much? You can actually see the snowman move now. And these ones are all snowman because they're topless. And this is not an M-rated game. 
Eh. Remember when AO was a rating that never existed? That was fun times. Ah, uh, the goodest boy has gotten the goodest victory. And my grammar has taken a nosedive into the deplorable. Hey, a chest. Where are the big snowman? There they are. You know, without inverse, they are much less threatening. It's kind of crazy. Well, also festive winds exist, so... Everything is less scary with festive winds. Five, four, three, two, one, zero, A. Interesting. Oh, let's see how long this can go on. Will I get a second death? Will it show up in the same as the first and get caught in the trail of flowery goodness? That was enable to anima evolve. Looks like Suto is getting the passion de amore if I not oh so huh. Nope, nope, ambush from above. Okay, that's one point one four on the bloody tear, festive winds. Strangely, not higher. So your bond a actually keeping somewhat of a pace. And Celestial Dustin... Well, there. Oh, Solon down. Alright, time to be classy with Sir Ambrojo. Well, let's see cooperates. Alrighty. Well, let's see how Sun Old Sanctuary does. For the gentleman in the toppest of hats. Boy, I hope I get some wep good weapons early. Nope, that can't evolve. Let's get rid of Magic Wand while we're here. Flash Arrow. But I don't have the things that evolve it. No, but lucky swipe. Clearly what I need is to focus on more stuff ahead of me, and not below me. Then I want you, Glass Fidango. Who would ever want you? Alright, now if I can just... just get some other stuff. Oh, and... da-da-da-da... Uh, Actually, knife would have been pretty good. I just wouldn't be able to evolve it. Rather multiplied by might. Well, I think 10 might is worth its own weight in might. That made sense. Hmm. Well, strange to go Jubilee twice in one video, but it does clear the bottom. Which is what I desperately need. So, oddly enough, Amber Joe is going Ramba's path just with way better starting weapon. Oh, bye bye, mini engineer. You do not stay. Oh, that's going to make the Among Us crew really, really difficult to play. Or what? You know, I never actually looked up what affects how long the furniture stays. Is it just base duration, or is it something else? Oh, just turn on this box fight. Empty tome first. Always empty tome first. Uh-oh. I was hoping for the Jubilee to do a bit faster. See if I can optimize myself by grabbing that spinach down there. Let's 
still so far away, though. Hey, good times with that empty tome. Faster furniture. You know you want it. Yeah, it wouldn't be so great if all your furniture just moved on its own. That way you didn't have to pick it up and flip the mattress. The springs, they hurt. And I flip the mattress more than you do. And it still hurts. Have you ever flipped your mattress? That's what the comment sections are before. That's what you want to comment on a Vampire Survivors video about. Mattress flipping. But hey, gotta get up to weird things when you got weird gameplay going on. Alright, this should be enough to get me to the spinage. And then I can just run north the entire time. Oh, hey, caveman. Alright. Snowman, caveman. That's not where you belong. Wow, the damage is bad. Oh, I suppose once I get spinach up, it'll be better. Still, this is significantly weaker than other things. I've been running. Yeah, the damage from La Roba is fine. It's not great, but it's fine enough. And also, they're not running in with the sheer ridiculous speed inverse gave them for some reason. Seriously, they were so insanely fast there. I would not have had this time there. And then... It's not like I have any sort of slow aura. Hey, more lucky swipe. One more projectile and base damage up again. Hey, there's my Arcana. What am I going to do with you? I quite literally have no idea. I think the beginning is the only thing I can do. I want as much damage as possible. Could have gone duplicator or spell error area with Can Arbor. But I wanted that sweet, sweet 75 attack. Oh, I also could have gone game killer. But I can't do that now. He is one of the better characters for it. What with that crazy starting amount. Oh, now they're getting wiped out in a single card. Nice. Oh, right. I'm gonna go grab that chest over here. And since I don't have Torona's box, that means it will not be anything possibly detrimental to me. Card's firing out a bit faster. Hmm. Oh yeah, in the Geno video with the solo, I finally deciphered what all that text meant. It took way too long, but it's in the description. And in the comment, if you want to go take a look at that and haven't seen it before, it was pretty funny and pretty eye raising to find out what it is. Oh, Jubilee gave me it when it needed. Alright, it should be a huge bunch of levels. Oh, yeah, straight to the finisher. Max out my damage, too. Yay! Almost maxed me out. I don't have any evolutions either, huh. Oh yeah, it's so much better. Still not as crazy as what Old Soul and Ramba were putting out. But pretty okay. Shouldn't have much trouble taking down old Kizune. Or young Kizune either. The old one comes out first. That's how you know it's old. So incidentally, checking the store to see if Guns Out had a timer. I rewatched the Moonspell DLC trailer. 
pretty obvious there that Menya was a woman. Myung less so from her animation, but from the voice, could have gotten that. Though you know how the old Bishone works. Bishonen works. Well, maybe you don't. That's basically Pretty Boy in Japanese. So, Myung could have totally been a pretty boy, but she turned out to be a girl. Some might be disappointed by that. I just accept the facts as they go. Like the fact that Ambro Joe is tearing through these robots. Aw oh, yeah. If I ever wanted to do like heavy gold eggs on a character, it would probably be Ambro Joe just because a little robot is a funny ability. And it would be classy to have him be all golden egged up. Don't you just want that dash class when you're destroying this many enemies? Man, without inverse, this stage loses a lot of its bite. Also, it's actually white out instead of pink out, so that helps. Yep, more Orologian goodness. More Orologian goodness. I got a small clover in there. Well, there is one around here, so let's go try and find that. There we go. Not as much as Ramba and Oso were picking up, but still. There's still time to get lucky enough to change that. Oh, hey, there you are, Kazune. You want to get lucky swiped? You want to get La Robot to the max? Uh, actually, how much La Robot can you put out? Let's see, you start out with beginning in, say, Game Killer. So you start out with 11 plus 3, so 14, 15, 16 from Duplicator. I think that's the most. So that's a lot of Laroba, I mean. Then you get a map with a bunch of other stuff on it. Some weapons. You really go for the game killer goodness there. Raw damage against the boss, not great though. Then again, one of them apparently went down and I didn't notice it. Oh, no, it didn't. I got it confused. Where's my Arcana chest? I gotta get the rule of three, even though Boss Rash doesn't have a third. No. With some other level that didn't have it. Heck, I might as well get out of bounds considering the sheer number of Aura Logians that spawn in. I mean, I should be fine against other stuff. Oh, that was dull. Oh, you know me. Dull as dishwasher. That's why you're not watching at this point. But for those of you who are, all two of you maybe, thanks for doing that. It seems whatever loci the algorithm was giving me last week has faded and I'm back down to my old view count of barely double digits. So those of you sticking around, thanks for watching. Thanks for any likes, comments, or subscriptions you give me. I was so giddy when I watched it suddenly spike up over the past couple days. But now it's declining. Oh well. I won't lie and say it's not disappointing, but it's on me. I'm clearly not entertaining enough. And you know, I'm not going to do some weird thing about other videos. Like, you're not my competitors, you're compatriots. It's not like we're competing for limited resources other than time itself. 
or something. I don't know. Well, why are you going so slow all of a sudden? Well, I really can't get rid of like 65, 6.5 million health, so. Uh, you have taken out the classiest man of them all, Death. How boorish. So there was a reason I thought I was going to Carlo Kart, huh? Oh well, that will be for later or something. I really should have checked this beforehand. Thanks for watching. If you'd be so kind as to like, dislike, comment, or subscribe, it would be really appreciated. Thanks if you already have. Please, if you haven't already. Have a good day and keep messing around.